Well, you can definitely feel the difference out there on this Thursday. Temperature-wise, across central and eastern Kentucky, finally getting some cooler air into the region, teasing with a few peaks of sunshine early. But clouds have won out, that upper-level system moving our way, so a few rain and snow showers closing out the week on Friday. Still looking fairly tranquil and dry heading into New Year's Eve. Colder and mainly dry as we kick off 2024 on Monday. Not a whole lot going on right now. Satellite and radar, although a few scattered snow showers trying to redevelop across southern Indiana, where this morning they had a little healthy swath of some accumulation on the grassy areas uh, about 30, 40 miles north of Louisville. The snow flying into parts of Illinois and eastern Iowa on the northwestern side of that upper level system. The actual surface low is sitting uh, across the Great Lakes. Pretty shot Lake Cumberland. You see the overcast conditions down across southern Kentucky. Our temperatures today much different than they have been the last couple of days. We're still 41 in Manchester, but 39 Lexington, 37 Danville, also Mount Vernon, as well as Mount Sterling. So compared to this time yesterday, a good 8 to 10 degrees cooler across much of the region, and not just here in the Commonwealth, but throughout the Ohio and Tennessee valleys. That coastal low just off the New England coast, causing a lot of problems with flooding there. The aforementioned uh, Great Lakes low setting over southern Michigan, but you see a lot of the moisture is back to our northwest. That's the upper level energy that lags behind. Notice here on our future cast, taking you through the evening hours, a lot of the activity, some of that stuff could sneak into the bluegrass, but I think the favored area for any snow showers overnight early tomorrow morning Morning, probably along and west and north of the I-65 corridor. And then tomorrow could see uh, at least a little bit of a rain snow mix at times. It'll be a chilly day, cloudy, with temperatures into the mid to upper 30s. And then looking ahead as we go into the final two days of 2023 on Saturday, other than a few snow showers and higher elevations in southeastern Kentucky early in the day, looking at uh, cloudy skies mainly, low 40s. And then that next little boundary comes in here as we get into Sunday, but it will be milder out ahead of it, so we'll spike up into the upper 40s, and then as that boundary sweeps on through, that's when temperatures will begin to cool down for the first day of 2024, the majority of the moisture staying off to our southeast, but uh, we'll see about 8-10 uh, degree drop for high Sunday into Monday, and then Tuesday, sunshine returns, so we're looking a little better in that regard. So tonight, uh, looking like, uh, say, low to mid-30s. Could see a few upper 20s in some of the uh, outlying areas, especially in southern and southeast Kentucky. Mostly cloudy tomorrow. A few rain and or snow showers. Again, if we see any burst uh, on the grassy areas at this point, that looks like it's mainly going to be just out to our west. But uh, anywhere's fair game heading into the day tomorrow. Again, southeastern Kentucky on Saturday. Low 40s, looking good on New Year's Eve. No issues if you're heading out to celebrate. Minimal chances, first day of 2024, as well as on Wednesday with the system to our south. But at least temperatures right around average for early January next week with highs in the low to mid 40s.